So there was a question about how did these fake marks were. So I now zeroed the, the indicator, which is a one thousandth of a millimeter indicator. So one division is is one thousandth, and then uh, you can see here it goes plus minus ten at least. So in the region of that, I've even had a little bit more in the region of plus minus one, which is, let's say it's a deviation of one thousandth of an inch then. I mean, plus minus one hundredth of a millimeter is a little less than one thousandth of an inch. So I wasn't quite finished yet. Uh, this is of course, uh, the CX-16, uh, the small uh, milling machine I have, which I will convert to CNC actually. Um, and then here is my Schäubin, or Schäublein, 52 uh, bigger milling machine. You can, uh, uh, what is apparent is of course the size of these two mills, but also the construction. And this is quite typical here of a uh, although special with the construction in, in in one respect, but at least typical for the let's say the new uh, fangled um, uh, mill drills or the derivatives uh, of a more uh, lightweight milling machine with a very la large throw as compared to the base. You see the, th the width of the base here compared to the throw of the table or the, the length of the table. In this respect here of course it's uh, 85 uh, centimeters long and the support here is about uh, 60. And actually the base here is 46. So the, the ratio is uh, very much in that favor but here you have a base of 18 and the length of the table of 57. And this has a throw um, which is comparably larger than this in comparison with the, with the base and everything. But of course this will then be much more sturdy. Um, so I think this is a, also a, a kind of a, not a sickness, but at least a, uh, for competition I guess they would want to to um, exploit as much as possible of a certain design and then maybe for competition purposes then stretch this envelope as far and beyond what is designed. And uh, while on this one they keep, I guess, uh, to a certain principle. Um, this one uh, will not go over, so it will only go as far as here as I'm uh, as far as I remember, so the throw here will be like, how much is it? If you take away 60 minus 18, so 40 centimeters. Um, on this one, uh, this can go further on, actually go here, so we have almost here inside, also this, this will go on the inside. See if I move this in, this can actually then move on the inside here as far as this table. And this has a throw, say 55 centimeters. I have, however, uh, shortened it, so it's now at um, 50. So not, not much more throw on this one as on this one. But you can imagine who is the, the better alternative if you want to mount something heavy or heavier or, or long. This will of course then be much better with regards to support and also then accuracy. It is not meant, I think, for this one to be used for long or for pieces that, that is on the unsupported side here. So that when you have such a piece, I think you can mount it for, for setups, but primarily just, of course, then on the supported side. I have boasted then also then thing with um, 
this um, um, flaking being on the unexposed side. So on this one, as I also meant to say, but can emphasize, you could of course, for the purpose of flaking, uh, flake this side also, but I wanted to avoid I wanted to avoid to do something with this uh, quite small surface here, uh, so I wanted to retain all the um, all the bearing points here, uh, and although it would have been unexposed, it would then lead to this being compromised, so to speak. Um, so. In my eyes, uh, flaking, as I've learned, is for oil retention and uh, and to extend the uh, the lifespan of a machine, not for looks. That's to my uh, understanding and my um, my learning. But then also then here, I just wanted to to show this. I think that this is also then a quite typical uh, aspect of um, of a small lightweight modern machine. For hobby use, that is, the table is uh, is overextended, so to speak. So be aware of that. Also, you will have effects of uh, of wear and uh, leading to diminishing accuracy if used um, to the extent of what is claimed as, let's say, throw on the or, or travel on the table. Okay, uh, time to put this together. But before I do that, I'll uh, I'll work on some efforts. So um, this will. It was just an exercise to, to show flaking because I thought that was uh, was nice to do, um, uh, to emphasize what I have learned at least on this. Thank you.